And so there we go. You see a little bit of chatter in it, but you can't feel it. Which, uh, by the time we, uh, oh, you can't see. By the time we give them a bit of a lap, a bit of a tidy up, a bit of a rub on the surface plate, they will be just perfect. So we're back to see how good these are. And I can tell you that while they feel different, there is no perceptible rock in there at all. There's two hundredths of a millimetre. Oop. I might take the three hundredths out from behind it. <laughs> and two hundredths is just getting in on the little chamfer at the edge. But that's all I'm seeing there. There, chamfer, 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 and I brought some dirt up off the table onto the surface plate. one start the back edge that's as solid as a rock it's nice and stable See this just a little bit of noise you can hear because it's not tight. But that's there'll be something in there, but it's certainly not enough to give me uh, any anything to worry about. That's for sure. hundreds doesn't even look like going anywhere. That feels really good. These um, bank bases here, the, the uh, ones where they're using this type of nut, these two, I bought them on eBay. Remember before I could flip them and they'd rock. And these are right these are rated at 60 kilos. There's a little bit of can't feel it, but yeah, I think it's just I think I'm just sitting it hard enough that I'm actually yeah. Um, these are rated at 60 kilos and, and they'll probably hold close to that um, under perfect theoretical ideal conditions but there is no way that they stick anywhere near 60 kilos when they um, That obviously that rocks when you tap that far out because you, you're bouncing it. I need to find the washer because there needs to be a washer under there. Um, 
they won't hold anywhere near 60 kilos when they're nowhere near flat. There's no perceptible rocking. Oh, that's exactly what I was trying not to do. Even the dust out of the air settles on this and you can feel it. Last thing that I'm doing here is I've got a there's a fluoro light over there and I'm lining that up and oh I don't know how to measure that this bottom face here to that face there I can just see a tiny little bit of delight through there. This one here is probably half that. So what that actually measures to, I don't know. Um, we'll have to come up with a way of measuring it. <laughs> I'll measure this one the same. That one there, I can see no light through it at all. Or on that one. That one there is perfect, perfectly square. You buy this. How accurate this is, I don't know. Yeah, that one is out a little bit. See how this came up. Let's see if it's as close as what I think it is. I can't see anything there. Wish I could show you this, bro. And I can't see. Can't see anything through there at all. Which, you know, it's only a mag base. That one there looks perfect. And so does that one there. So what we'll do is we'll come to a good Japanese one. There's a couple of little dings in this edge here. They don't reflect on the back anymore because it's been ground, but when you feel them under when I feel them under my fingers it, <laughs> it bugs me. <laughs> okay. That's as close as that's ever gonna be. So, these three here are absolutely perfect. At 90 degrees and ground and straight. This one here is the same. I suppose there's a reason why this one's red. It's burgundy, but we'll call it red. Red is always a warning. Might have to go back and give this one another rub later on, but oh, this yeah. 
I see a grain of dirt under it. The amount of light that I can see through there, I can see light for about three millimetres back here. I reckon that's close enough. I think I had a little bit of dirt on the uh, on this bottom face here. So, job successfully completed. It's taken me uh, all afternoon to do that. There's uh, with filming and that. There's let's see. There's probably close to five hours, four and a half, five hours of. Uh, to film it, grind it, set it up, grind it, um, talk about it, and now there's probably that again, if not more, we're actually going and producing it. So, uh, yeah, the rest of the day, go and produce it. Thanks for watching.